Well, hello everyone. My name is Ashkan, and I'm here with my teammates Parveen, Hashani, and Jack. We are from Center of uh, Car Accident Research and Road Safety Queensland, or Cars Q in short. Uh, well, let's start with uh, explore the mechanics of advertising. When you are uh, encountering and hearing uh, repeatedly a product advertisement on TV show or I don't know, on a, other platforms, uh, it registers in your mind, in your uh, memory. So um, later when you are in a store looking for a similar item, you probably, um, the familiar name catches your eye. So um, this rec recognition prompts you to choose the product that you've heard about that before. So um, uh, this will be uh, something beyond your mind, uh, something in your subconscious that uh, made the trust you to uh, buy the product. So if we want to um, increase the trust and acceptance and awareness about V2G uh, technology to to the community. So we need something like that. We need to go through um, users' uh, subconscious. And for uh, this purpose, uh, we, propose, we propose that updating the terms and conditions of warranties of uh, EVs for new users or EVs batteries for current users who want to replace their battery uh, will be a motivation to enhance their awareness uh, of uh, benefits of uh, using V2G technology and increase the trust and acceptance of the technology. Uh, thanks, Ashkan. Um, so the issue at hand is essentially um, surrounding the negative stigma around V2G uh, utilization. So this is attributed to uh, the incurred battery degradation as a result of the increased um, charging cycles involved. Um, so this is certainly a barrier towards uh, encouraging households to participate in uh, V2G practice. So our solution to combat this is to uh, implement a battery warranty, a new battery warranty scheme uh, with any new EV purchase or battery replacement purchase, which is uh, inclusive uh, and covers um, V2G utilization. So not only does this solution uh, negate the perceived risk to the consumer, but it allows households to liberally participate um, in V2G practice um, without having to worry about um, the diminishing of battery health or the potential monetary loss that might be incurred. Uh, yeah. So we have also undertaken a literature review here and um, we have found that there is certainly a correlation um, between uh, consumer preference when purchasing a battery electric vehicle and um, the warranty offered with the product. And we can see here through what has been highlighted um, Oops, there is a positive correlation um, and um, it is of a 95% significance, um, which shows that there is backing behind our uh, warranty, battery warranty solution. And I'll now be passing it on to Hishani. Hello everyone. Saying so, utilizing this framework, we propose a straightforward blueprint for leveraging behavioral insights to encourage EV customers to embrace the V3D technology. So, how easy is that? Warranty is coming prescribed in your battery. If you are a new customer who is purchasing an vehicle, so your battery is covered by your warranty. And if you are an existing customer who has a, already a new battery, and if you are worried, we will update your terms and conditions to support that your battery is covered if any losses occurred because of the V2D technology. And if you are a customer who is replacing your battery, these battery manufacturers will provide you the warranty so you do not have to worry. So how easy is that? And then attractiveness. What is more attractive? This comes with the manufacturer recommended warranty period. So manufacturer guarantees that it will cover five years or eight years, whatever it is. Manufacturer guarantees whatever failures occurs in V2D technology or whatever, it will be covered by the manufacturer. So how attractive is it? And not only that, when you do the V2D technology, you will get an extra income. 
so it's good for your pocket. And the, we can do a mobile application to engage and get them their uh, inside uh, ability to boost their income. So it's real-time data gathering and information will provide data, and then you will feel like, oh, I should do this, I should do this, I can gain more. So what's more attractive than that? Uh, so while it is important that we have a, an attractive solution to customers, we also need to ensure that we are able to get that widespread uh, public, um, I guess, adoption of the technique and change the social norms and behaviours that are currently limiting V2G technology. Um, so for us, that kind of looks like um, convincing customers that the warranty is an essential part of the electric vehicle purchase. So we want to be able to convince the customers that any positives, uh, or all the positives rather, um, associated with the updated warranty terms and conditions outweigh any of the negatives. So we've kind of come up with three key ways in which we want to do that. Uh, the first of which we are going to present um, to EV users that the earnings, the V2G, um, the people using V2G are receiving is giving them that added financial benefit. So research suggests that 13.6% um, is the average saving on EV charging costs that V2G users receive while still maintaining that minimum level of battery usage so they can still use their vehicle. So this not only addresses the uh, financial anxiety, um, but it also addresses uh, range anxiety as people are still able to use their vehicles. Um, from there, we also want to be able to use um, positive user experiences to harness social change through social media marketing. Um, and that looks like for us um, using these positive experiences um, on social media tools to introduce these new ideas and theories that are backed in research to uh, use the V2G technology across these platforms. So Facebook specifically is a great tool for building a positive brand awareness. Um, and we believe we can do a similar thing with the V2G technology to roll out awareness or public awareness of V2G so that people are able to reduce their barriers of entry to using the technology as they are more aware of how the technology works. Um, finally, we also want to um, make sure that we implement the processes in a timely manner. So we've identified three different ways in which we believe uh, will be essential in marketing the campaign. So it's all well and good that we have these social, that we are understanding these social cues and how to remove them, but if we're not implementing it at an optimum time, we won't be able to change this. So we believe that the three best times to do it are firstly with the purchase of a new vehicle, also when you are replacing a, a battery in an existing vehicle, and then also in times like now when we have economic downturn and a, so a cost of living crisis. So during these times, people are more receptive to information as they're looking for good deals and ways to earn additional income. So we believe that marketing during this time will optimise our solution and allow us to reach more people and have a wider public adoption of the V2G technology. Well, we are all agree that approaches like education will be a good solution to increase their uh, maybe uh, use of V2G technology. But uh, this is time consuming since, uh, since uh, people are struggling with different uh, issues uh, during their uh, daily lives. So they couldn't uh, put attention to uh, new learning things. So uh, the technology that they didn't even realize that or feel that it's required for their lives. So we think that uh, our technology is very good. Uh, our proposed uh, approach is very good, uh, fast, simple, and effective, especially in uh, short times and mid-term uh, mid uh, periods. Yeah, thank you.